Hi everyone, this is Jean. So I saw this lettering delights nutcracker boxes as VGs and I wanted to play with them but I don't have the time to deal with the layers so I decided to print and cut them out instead. Now I can print and cut these as VGs because they come embedded with colors and also by printing and cutting them out I don't have to worry about putting together the small little layers especially when I reduce the size of the boxes. So let me show you how I do that with the Silhouette Studio and I'm using the Designer Edition that allows me to import SVGs. So I will be using file number one. And the first thing I would need to do is to make sure that the image lands within the cut zone. So I'm going to show the registration marks. And position the image so that it is within the area defined by the red square or the red outline and that it doesn't get into the shaded area now the SVGs come with their cutting lines and I noticed that many a times the program does not automatically turn on the cut lines for you. So in this case it is indicated as no cut even though there are cut lines. And if I should turn on the cut lines everything will be cut out which means that essentially the whole box will be shredded. And if I select cut the edge it will cut out the edge of the box which would work except that I really want the slit inside to be cut out as well so that I can close the box. Now I'm going to show you an easy fix for that. Just right click and ungroup and select only the cut lines of the base layer to be turned on like that. So now if I should print and cut the cameo will print out will cut out the box as well as the slit and actually um, indicate the score lines as well. So this SVG set includes six different designs and for box number two and box number four an additional step may need to be taken because the score lines will be printed out as these white dash lines and they may not look very nice on the completed project. So, but there's an easy fix to it, just change these lines, these white lines to be the same color as the background. So just ungroup the image and use the color picker to click on the background color and all the dash lines will now be the same color as the background. So they are still there when we turn on the cut lines but they will not show when printed. Alright, so basically that's it. It is ready for print and cut. Just click on the silhouette icon on the top here and um, follow the instructions to print and to cut the image out. And so try it out. Have fun with um, this set. And if you need the written instructions, just head back to my blog under a cherry tree.com. And um, thanks for watching this video. Bye.